Here's how to delete all posts on Facebook. Now, if you wanted to just delete all your posts, you didn't want to mess with any of those older posts, you can always remove them all. I'll show you how to do it. Let's hop into Facebook here, and you have a couple different options. Let's tap on menu at the bottom right, and then let's tap on the gear icon at the top right. Now, if we scroll down, you can see on here posts, you can go in here, and there's one option that you might want to choose. You can limit who can see past posts. So you can tap on that and just hit limit past posts. This will prevent a bunch of people from being able to see any of those old posts and help to keep your privacy on all of those older posts. If you just wanted to do this, this prevents you from having to delete every single one of those posts. So this is an option, but if you do want to delete all of them, let's go back and go back and then hit see your profile. Now we'll tap on those three dots on the bottom right here and then we'll tap on activity log. This will show all of your activity on Facebook, including all of your posts. So once this loads up, we can hit the filters at the top left and then hit categories. Now at the very top, let's tap on posts and let's choose any of these. You can choose all of them, photos and videos, text updates, Let's choose that. Now the easy thing here is that you can just go through this list and just tap these three dots and hit the move to trash. Tap the three dots, hit move to trash. Unfortunately, there's no one way to be able to select all of these and delete them all with one click. You can always just delete your entire account or temporarily suspend your account if you wanted to deactivate it and not have anyone be able to see any of your posts. But beyond that, you can't just select all of your old posts and delete them all in one click. Facebook just doesn't allow that. So you can either filter it so you change the privacy and people can't see your old posts. You can delete them one by one or you could always just temporarily or permanently deactivate or delete your account. Hope this helps. If you have any questions on that, leave them in the comments down below and I'll catch you on the next one.